What's up everybody, KG here, coming at you with a quick video to show you how to connect to the new Ethereum Proof of Work Network, which is a fork of Ethereum mainnet that came as a result of the Ethereum merge to Proof of Stake. Now, this network is not an official network of the Ethereum Foundation. It is a fork of Ethereum, and with it, came a full system state copy, which means that if you had ERC-20 tokens on Ethereum at the time of this fork, you got a one-to-one -one copy of all of your Ethereum tokens. So I'm gonna show you how to connect to this network and access the copies of your free tokens. You may hear this network referred to as ETH Ethereum Proof of Work, ETH POW, or ETH W. Let's jump right in. This is a quick and easy tutorial, and I will share all official links to everything referenced in this video down in the description. So as a precursor to this video, you're going to need MetaMask installed. We're not gonna get into that in this video. I assume you already have it. Once you're in MetaMask, you are going to go to your networks, and if you are on mobile, it's the little, the three little hamburger icon in the top left, and then you add the networks from there. But here on desktop, go to add network, and I'm going to copy and paste the settings from my end over here. And again, I will share it so that you have all the official settings to verify this for yourself, which is good crypto practices for any video that you're following, always verify. The crypto world is shady and you need to be careful out there. Chain ID, 10,001. Currency symbol, ETHW. Block Explorer. Is right here. You may get this setting that is okay. It is just a warning, or you may get this warning, not setting. Go ahead and click save. Now you are connected to the ETHW mainnet. And you'll see I already have a little ETHW, which is the native token coin for this blockchain. And if you have one ETH, you're gonna automatically see one ETH right here. So exactly the amount of tokens you had on Ethereum mainnet is how many tokens you're going to have here. So how do you check your free copies? Well, that's easy. You go ahead and click import tokens like you normally would. And we're going to practice with two tokens here. We're going to practice with the hex token. And again, I'll drop the, the link so you can see the official address. And this is a warning you might, or an error you might see. This address matches a known Ethereum mainnet token address. Recheck the contract address and network for the token you are trying to add. That's because the system state copy took all the contracts with it. So every contract that you know, or every token address that you know on Ethereum mainnet is gonna be the same address for the ETH POW network. It's the same exact address. So if you get this error, all you have to do is type in the token symbol and the decimals, which you can find on Etherscan and click add custom token. There it is, import tokens. And you will see that I have a copy of my hex. Now let's go ahead and try with one more token. I'm gonna test it with USDC you're gonna see the same error for this one, USDC, six decimals, and you're gonna see that I have some USDC there. And that's it. In this video, I'm not gonna get into how to swap the tokens. I just wanted to show you how to access the ETHPOW network and access your free tokens, the airdrop of all of your ERC-20 tokens. And again, when you're operating on these networks, I always recommend before you connect to any dApps, 
it would be bet or even import networks that you're not comfortable with. Create a dummy wallet, which is a brand new seed phrase. Connect to the network through there. And then you can even send all of your tokens to this dummy wallet. I'm not saying you have to do this, but if you're nervous about interacting with this network or any dApps on this network, that is a security precaution you can take. Again, all official links will be in the description. Thank you for taking the time to watch. I appreciate you. Like and subscribe if it was helpful. And until next time, have a good day. Peace.